We're here at a large commercial building at the center of the city. This just so happens to be a church, kind of the center of the community. It's an honor and a privilege to be able to do a building of this magnitude. Started with consultative process with the head of the church and their team. The most important part of a project like this, being that it's open and the building is in use through the duration of the project is communication uh, with the customer. Lime was really communicative. It all started with, in the beginning, we had a walkthrough of the entire building with Nick and Matthew, and then they were very clear about what was gonna be covered in the proposal and they made a deadline for when they thought they'd be done and they, they met that deadline. During our initial consultation, we were able to advise them on solutions beyond just the paint. We talked to them about the stucco, the direct metal that makes up the windows and accents. We also advised them on the brick, which was deteriorating. And we consulted them on the nuance structures like the cross and signage. All of this transformed and revitalized the building, making it an engaging symbol within the community. There's three different colors that are being applied to this building. So the idea with this is that it draws your eyes up. And the dark color is up, the mid-tone color is middle, the light color is at the bottom. We ended up doing the job segment by segment. So uh, starting with the stucco, moving around the building, then doing the next section, and then uh, doing all the DTM, the direct to metal surfaces. And then lastly, we're going to do the bricks. After our mason comes and fixes and tuck points some of the, the areas that need to be fixed. And then we're gonna be coating those bricks as well to get a protective coating on there and make sure every aspect of the building is touched. The roof, we had to do a lot of work, a lot of prep, a lot of diligent detail on that as well. Nobody's ever gonna see that. But the important thing is that we're covering it, we're protecting it. All the same details that go into the outside of the building go onto the roof as well. These are areas that are only gonna be seen by a few people, maintenance people at most, and we're taking care of them just as we would any other surface on the building. Going into this process, we had an outdated building with outdated colors. We like to say that it looked like an Aztec strip mall, and people didn't really know it was a church. It just didn't look good for us, forward-facing to the community. So obviously as a church, like outreach and how we present ourselves to the community is really important. And so we feel like through this process with Lyme, um, we were able to kind of transform the whole outside of what the church looks like. This project is a grand example of how we do much more than just paint for commercial facilities. And we are very honored that we were able to align with an organization that shares our core values of love, integrity, mission, and excellence. I would definitely recommend that everyone get limed.